Okay, turn it on. Hiding inside the hometown of Homer Simpson, O'Connor's Irish Pub gives you the eye candy. Believe it or not, Springfield once produced the most roses than any other city in the country, giving it the nickname the City of Roses. I do not recommend that you travel here to Springfield. However, I do recommend that you go to O'Connor's. So how would you get there? Well, I don't know. While well, pulling into the place, you are ensconced with the patio's beauty. There is greenery, high-top tables, games, a couple of TVs, and a full bar with Guinness and patties. And a little bit of crack. There are ashtrays for the smokers, and that ring on a string game for the athletes. Years back, you see O'Connor's opened up their doors a few blocks down the street. And after filling the place up every week, they figured, ha, we need a bigger building. So they moved into this one. You could tell that somebody put a lot of thought in this venue. The architecture and the craftsmanship certainly gives you the feel goods. Upon entry, you are greeted with enough wall decor to keep you busy for a while. The light fixtures here are wonderful, while the furniture is as good as the rest. There are two bathrooms here at O'Connor's. While they are both clean and tidy, one of them gives you a bit of that commercial restaurant feel to it. The bar itself is positioned perfectly, with a nice stain of wood and a layout that holds about 20 or so guests. They pour an average pint of Guinness, and the beers here on tap are certainly satisfying the cravings. They provide a marvelous collection of whiskey, and there's a Kino machine close by for the drinkers. There are plastic darts and a pool table in the back that gives a slight uptick on the crack. O'Connors might not be worthy of being considered a hidden gem. However, they are certainly worthy of receiving the nod. This is not your typical rinky-dink small-town pub with a slab of green paint. I assure you that if you do happen to be driving through Springfield that you will want to make the pit stop here for a liquid lunch. I certainly left out a lot of details about the place, so please check out the entire article about O'Connor's for free at thedrunkenmallard.com. I'm off to another pub. So launch it. Crap, it doesn't work. Ah!